Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is day two of my vlogmas. So I just wanted to show you guys some hairstyles you could do once you take your braids out because sometimes when you take your braids out, your hair is like on point. So I wanted to go ahead and show you guys how I style my hair after I take my braids out. But without further ado, let's go ahead and dive right into this video. So first things first is I'm going to be taking out my braids. Now I braided my hair two days ago because I was kind of tired of my hair always gets tangled if I just leave my hair in a bun and I'm sure you guys know that if you guys are always putting your hair in a bun. But my hair is always, almost always huh, like getting tangled especially since I need to cut my hair. Um, I keep telling you guys that I need to cut my hair. Isn't it crazy that I have not found anyone to cut my hair yet? So I am really debating, contemplating on cutting my own hair. Just to trim. I just need to trim. I've been seeing on YouTube and I think I'm just going to go ahead and trim my hair. Um, but yeah. And if I'm looking off camera, it's because um, there's a mirror in front of me actually. So. I'm going to take it off halfway because I'm going to show you guys what you guys can do if you if your hair like in the front my hair is it's still kind of nice but it's still kind of messy so I don't really mind um, most of the time my hair has to be perfect but um, a mommy on the go it don't really matter <laughs> so I'm just going to take my hair off halfway you guys probably could have done this hairstyle with the braids on but I'm going to do it without the braids because like it's going to look cute either way. Uh, uh, uh. So we just take our hair out of the braid. Now for the first hairstyle is we're going to use bobby pins. Now I have this big tank of bobby pins. Um, I always buy this. I bought this at Sally's. They have like a whole bunch but I always just get the big ones because um, I end up running out of bobby pins for some reason. You guys know what I mean. So the first hairstyle we're going to do, let me pull my sleeves up because we're about to do some work. <laughs> so is pretty much putting your hair in a bun line. Your hair is already braided. Now what we're going to do is twist our hair and we're just going to take it up and we're just going to make it like a little bun because it's really simple little bun hairstyles. So just take a bobby pin and we're going to bobby pin the top of our head like so. Now when I bobby pin, I always bobby pin over each other like this so that it locks the hair in place. If you do it like, if you do it like, I just dropped it. If you do it like this and you bobby pin your hair like this, sometimes your hair just comes out so I always overlap it. So just twist our hair. I don't really know how to do a bun that way. So we're just gonna try. I don't I normally do my buns the other way, but for this hairstyle, we're just gonna go the, uh, the opposite way. I always because I'm right-handed, so my hair. Then you just grab your bobby pin. And you bobby pin the top like so. Yeah, so that yeah, that's pretty much your first hairstyle that you guys can do on the go. Just fix the top, you know. I kind of like it messy because it like, shoot, I'm a mom on the go, you know. I gotta go. But that's pretty much a simple, easy hairstyle that you guys can do after you take your hair in a braid. Instead of having to go wash it, you guys can do like different hairstyles. Pretty much take your hair out. Let it be braid. And you can either leave your hair down like so. And that's what I like about like braiding my hair because you can always do different hairstyles and it's easy to manage because like curly hair, your hair is like you have to style your hair when it's wet or sometimes when it's dry, it's like really hard to manage. But when I have my hair like this, it's like really see it? If you guys don't like it like that, you guys can always, always put your hair up 
like this. You just grab a little of the side right here. And I like it like that. So you just grab a little bit and you twist right there. You grab your bobby pin. And then I take my other one. And like I told you guys, I do the diagonal. And I take it and I overlap it. See how I overlap it? Just so I can hold the hair. See, it holds the hair in place very good. Then you take the other side, take the top, and then you just twist it. And then you grab your other bobby pin and you twist the top. This, this is I go over and then I take the other one pin and then I go so that, and that's pretty much the other hairstyle. And the next hairstyle, which is super easy. You guys can like pin the top with this. I just twist it up. So you just pretty much grab right here and then you just start twisting upwards. It's really simple hairstyle after you take your braid out. You grab a bobby pin and you pin the top and you grab it and you overlap it. You just overlap it. I like overlapping my bobby pins, guys. <laughs> but you keep overlapping it. And I just keep doing it like this. So you just body pin the end and you just leave it like that and you're good. Boom. You leave this part down, grab this, twist it back like so and then bobby pin right here just leave it like that and you just sign it like that and have it like style where you have your bang right here and you can even grab like a hair clip and then you can clip it like right here right here and grab another one and you can clip it right here or you can take this part and just like go over it like that and then just have it like this grab your bobby pin and you just bobby pin the back with that like take it up a little bit and just leave your hair like that. Oh my gosh, so easy, y'all guys. So easy. There's so many ways to do your hair. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Really simple and easy ways to have your hair down after you take your hair out in a braid. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Now I'll see you guys in my next video. All right, bye guys.